everyone, so I thought I'd do a remake of my plug collection. It's slightly updated because there's a few more things I've, I've bought. Um, the main reason I'm redoing this is because a lot of people commented last time saying I didn't really show my ears. Which, I didn't realise people would really want to see my ears because an inch is going to look different on different people dependent on your frame, your ears, your lobes, everything. But hey, people wanted to see it so I thought I'd do that. Um, I have pre-filmed all of the plugs in my ears and I'm going to sort of like do a voiceover saying the makes and I'll link the website in the description below for all of these. I can't tell you how much these are because, well, I could tell you how much they are now but it won't be the same as when I bought them. So it'll be easy to just link all the websites in down below and I'll just obviously, as I go through, say what makes they are. Um, I've only changed them in one ear in this video because if I were to do it in this, this ear, this ear gets aggravated really, really quickly. And this ear was getting sore just changing them from all of these. I kept having to put oil on my ear um, just to because it was getting a little bit sore. I so yeah, I've only I'm only changing one ear. I'm showing you what it looks like, and then showing you it in my ear. And there's quite a lot of them. Um, a few different like I've got a lot of acrylic, some fun fancy ones, and etc. So that's I think the only bit of talking I'll do. I'll then just whiz through all of the plugs that I've currently got at an inch. And when I say an inch. I've got some plugs in here that are 24 millimeters and some that are 25, depending on what website I've bought them from. Because some people call 24 an inch, which I don't understand why, because it's not. And one, some people obviously say 25 is an inch, because 25 is should be two, two and a half centimeters. But hey ho, it depends on the website you're buying it from. Um, I believe all of these ship worldwide, but I'm not too sure. Some of the companies I bought from were based in the UK, some were based in America. So I think you'll just have to look into each individual company and see what they say. I've had good, um, I've had good service with all of these companies. I have yet to mention uh, webs. I've yet to do a video on an experience I had with a company with, that was absolutely dreadful. And yeah, I've been planning that for ages, but I just know I'm going to get so frustrated filming. So all of these companies, I would highly, highly recommend. Um, Especially one of the Etsy ones I will link at the end just because some of the things they've done for me has just been so so nice and it's just all of these are run by great people or that's the experience I've had with them uh, so yeah I will quit rambling I'll probably stop it in now because I'm probably won't be doing much more talking apart from the plugs I plan to be doing a piercing video at some point for some people if you're interested because these videos seem to be the most popular uh, about two three months ago I got a Christina piercing so I will probably do a video talking on that Obviously, I would never show it, but if if that's something people want me to talk about, it was an idea I had for a video, but I wanted to wait until it was fully healed so I don't jinx myself, um, and it's still kind of healing-ish. So if that's interested, then you know, let me know in the comments if that is actually something you want to see. And I've got a few reviews and stuff coming up, but I thought I'd just drop this in here now, just so you know that I do have some things planned, but life keeps happening and <sighs> things getting in the way, and so yeah, I will quit rambling. And I'll just start doing the voiceover of all the plugs now. Okay, so this first, pretty much all of these acrylic ones I'm about to show you all come from um, customplugs.co.uk, I can't remember, I'll link it below. Uh, I've also got a white floral one, a blue florally skull one. I tend to wear the white floral ones every day for work because they just look in your face. But yeah, I've got these pink floral ones with a cross on them. However, you want to. Clearly, I put it in the wrong name, so I am going to adjust it now. There we go. So, yeah, um, I've got these like purple galaxy ones. Again, all of these are custom plugs at the moment, but they're all pretty much the same price. Um, kind of a mandala y type of one. And these alley ones, I actually got sent three of these ones when I bought some. Um, uh, custom, actually custom ones I designed and they were a couple of weeks late which I think was really good of them because I totally didn't expect them to send me them but I really do like them, they're quite cute and one of my favourite pairs is the one with the cats it looks like a tapestry handbag which is amazing because well cats, because from far away you can't even tell they're cats and then you get close and I just really like these ones, they're another one I wear every day and just kind of like a sphinxy sort of cat <coughs> excuse me uh, these ones I got custom made for um, Christmas, obviously. It fits with my cat wearing a Christmas hat. A photo I took that I just turned into a plug. And then, obviously, you need Macaulay Culkin in your life because Home Alone is all about Christmas. 
These ones aren't from Customs Mug. Um, they're from Stretch Your Body Jewelry. They're the ones that they sent me through to review. You might remember those. Um, these are from Customs Mugs as well. These are just the stone ones. I think all the stone ones from Customs Mugs. Um, these are rose quartz. I've also got Amethyst. And I've got these Opalite ones. Which I really like because from the back all I can see is yellow and all you can see here is blue. So I really like these to change the colour. These I got from Arctic Buffalo. That was what it was called. And two have got like a turquoisey and a red sort of... Uh, rose. These I got from Arctic Buffalo as well, which I absolutely adore. Uh, there's these wooden sort of flower. My boyfriend calls them my uh, gramophone earrings. These I got from Stretch Your Body Jewelry. Unfortunately, I can't really wear these much anymore because I had a bad reaction. And um, these are just plain chaos silicone earrings. Um, I got these off Amazon just because I wanted some to sleep in initially. These are chaos. Uh, I think they're called the skins. Um, this is a pearl pink. I'm also going to show you the pearl, I think it's sky blue, and I've also got a pearl sort of mint green colour. I don't wear these this often because I forget I've got them to be honest, but they're ideal for summery weather. These are some really, really cheap, horrible um, skin colour flesh plugs that I bought for a ballet performance. They're actually slightly smaller, 22mm. Um, this is just a... Oh, this one's from Custom Plugs as well actually, I think. And this one's from Body Jewelry Shop. And um, those silicone ones, the skins I got from BodyJewelryShop.com as well. I should mention that. Uh, this I got from, I think they're called the Little Plug Shop, um, or Little Plug Company on Etsy, I'll link them below. Um, they've got some really cute ones, so I've got the, that blue tunnel and the sort of orangey pineapple plug that I'm kind of looking forward to wearing on holiday because I think they're so summery. Uh, these are, oh, all these ones, these ones I'm about to show you are from somewhere called Stella Noir on Etsy and she's absolutely fabulous. I bought these first two pairs and this third pair I'm about to show you, she sent me for free when I bought all the others, which I thought was so nice of her because I just absolutely adore all of her plugs. So these ones she sent me free, uh, because all the ones I'm about to show you I bought, I did like a put in a massive order, um, because these these plugs aren't cheap, I'll put it that way, but they are lovely, they are so worth it, and they're worth the wait, and the custom service with her is fantastic. And I've made it my mission to collect the whole set of all of her plugs. Um, I just absolutely adore all of them. And um, yeah, this is the last pair I've got from her, and also the last pair. Um, so this is pretty much where I'm going to end the video. So thank you for watching this video guys. Uh, I hope it was easier to see them now and it's shown a few new ones in there. Sorry I had to rush through them all but if I didn't do it like that this video would be really really long and I was trying to keep it to a minimum so you just of just showing you this is the plug, this is what it looks like and then obviously saying what the company is and I've got a little bit of the voiceover saying where they're from but I think everywhere that I bought for, from was pretty much Amazon, Custom Plugs, Body Jewelry Shop, Arctic Buffalo and different sellers on Etsy. But again, I'll link all below. If there's anything you want me to go over, let me know. And if you've got any questions, leave them below and I will do my best to answer them. Uh, as I said before I did this, I have got, hopefully, a few videos planned. Um, I might put them in the description, the sort of things I've got planned. And if there's anything you want me to do, leave it below because I do like requests. Um, they are very, very helpful. And when I'm in a rush with my life and everything, it helps me just pick one and go, boom, that's what people want, then I can do it. But, yeah, thank you for watching this, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.